Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and welcome to The Day Trader. My name is Martin Lucas. I'm here live every morning for the opening and closing bell on multiple platforms. The home of our trading, of course, is here on YouTube. That's the home of our trading. Welcome, everyone. And uh, everything you see here is real, genuine, my real money, my real positions. In fact, all my money in the, in the world, it's all here on view for all of you to see. And we go live every morning and every evening for the opening and closing bell. And uh, you can see exactly what we're doing. We're also joined by amazing people around the world, amazing traders who join me every day from the very, very small to the very, very large. And uh, we're live here on TikTok, uh, Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, multiple websites. But the home is, of course, here on YouTube, which, of course, is youtube.com forward slash the day trader one. There is the YouTube broadcast there for all of you over there on TikTok. Right. You want to see my trades? Let's get straight into it right now. Here we go. There you go. There are my trades on the screen for you now. Just click subscribe, ring the bell, and give us a thumbs up. Drillian is already in the house. Let me bring Drillian up onto the screen. Welcome, Drillian. Thank you ever so much for being here. Thank you so much indeed. Up there on the screen already. Great stuff. Uh, that's Drillian. As you can see, it's uh, five past eight in the evening in the UK. That's the UK clock up there, even though I'm here in uh, Dallas, Texas. Welcome to all of you. Good morning, uh, good afternoon, Guy. Is it Ger? Gerpreet? Gerpreet, I think that's right. And Thomas, how are you, Thomas? Emily Wilson, thank you for joining us. All right, today we are up. A uh, very, very good day today. We're up 5% right now, $36,349. Very, very nice indeed. Drillion is, is our first one here. Let's go to our stocks. Evgo had a great day, up 10% today. Not quite yet in the money, but uh, looking a lot, lot healthier. Camber Energy, we talked about this. Uh, oil, I'm no longer in that kind of stuff. Uh, it's speculative, gambling, all the rest of it. I'm not in it anymore, as you can see. There is, uh, there is our position there with Camber Energy. I came out of it. McDonald's is up 0.81% today. McDonald's is up what? Up 0.81. SoFi up 3% today. I'm still 16% down, but much, much better. Vu, I moved heavily into Vanguard today. I've put my money in the S&P 500. I like it. Very low uh, cost for, the, for, for this ETF. Um, it brings stability to my, um, my trades. I like it a lot. Very happy with it. Um, if you want to ask me any questions about any of my stocks, if you're watching on TikTok and you want to see any of my positions on any of my stocks, let me know. Can I get rid of that movie magic? Will that movie magic go? It's a thing that uh, TikTok have stuck in the way. No, it just seems like it's stuck there. Never mind. All right, uh, Vanguard S&P 500 ETF up uh, nearly uh, three quarters of percent this afternoon. The House Intelligence Committee had a meeting on threats to America. Please, everyone, check it out. Very interesting times. Nicholas Morello, the House Intelligence Committee. I was watching it. I saw it. Yes, they believe that nuclear nuclear war is closer than ever. Yeah, I saw that. It's quite frightening, right? Uh, I'm in Ark today. Oh, very, very nice. Uh, one of uh, one of my uh, one of my favourite stocks. Uh, I'm in Ark. Uh, let me uh, bring it up. A R K K. Ark Innovation. It's all about innovation. Uh, it's up today, three and a half percent. It's still down twenty percent, but uh, much. Much, uh, much into this one. Uh, I'm in ARC today. There we go. Nicholas Morello, thank you very much indeed for joining me in ARC. Fusion took a gamble on HYMC, praying for a power hour boost. Fusion, I wish you all luck with that. I do indeed. Uh, hello, mates. Mike 166A, welcome to Mike. Uh, looking, looking good today. Uh, I've really changed uh, my perspective and gone back to how I started, how I grew this portfolio from 5,000 to 58. No more taking the gamble gambles, no more chasing stocks that have already popped. Don't believe in that. I never did, uh, but uh, I've got out of that now. So uh, anyway, we're back into much, much more reliable stocks and long-term investing. I still believe in scalping. I still believe in day trading. I still believe in swing trading, all the things I've, I've been doing all the time, but uh, a bit more focus on the long-term investments. Want to make sure that we stick to that as well. Let's bring uh, back into the trades once again. Here we go. Uh, let's bring everybody up. Hello, mates. 
Right, one more show to go. Uh, so here we go. Here's the poll. Here's the poll. You know what it's going to be. Who's joining me in the morning? Whoops. Uh, that's the first question. And have you shared tomorrow's video to get 100 live viewers there we go i know i've got no chance at all but you never know you never know uh who's joining me in the morning have you shared tomorrow's video to get 100 live viewers there we go. Question, question, question. Drop it in there. And I'm going to give you the video again, just in case you haven't yet done it. This is, uh, this is the video. That will be tomorrow's video. So we'll go back to the day trader. And uh, here it is. This is the upcoming live stream in the morning. I will uh, share that with you once the trailer's played again, because the trailer always plays when I bring it up. Anyway, that's happening in the morning, my birthday. Uh, how we, 21 people now on TikTok. Well, welcome to all of you. Thanks for the follow. Hi, guy. Click the likes and follow me. You're seeing all my real trades, my real positions here on the screen. Arc Innovation. Um, let's have a look right now. Um, as you can see, doing well today. Evgo, doing well. Camber. Just wanted to show you there what we, what what we've been doing, but we're out of it now. McDonald's, um, there's McDonald's right now. Uh, up today, nearly one percent. SoFi up three percent. A high all. What a day, indeed it is. I'll do my best to be there tomorrow. <laughs> Nudge it, budget, move it. Our sponsors in the house. We'll do a big uh, thing tomorrow for Nudget Budget Move It. We're expecting our biggest ever audience. Uh, hopefully, you never know. And we'll certainly do a big thing for Nudget Budget Move It in the morning. All right. So uh, join us for that tomorrow morning. Okay. Um, I want uh, if I... No, I'll do that tomorrow. I'll worry about that tomorrow. I was just thinking of something now out loud, but uh, not to worry. Hi, Beetle Sean. Hi, Beetle Sean is here as well. Right, so far. Now, Vu. Uh, this is the Vanguard S&P uh, 500 ETF. I have bought 12 shares of this today. It's now one of my biggest positions. 7% uh, of my portfolio is in it. Uh, there it is on the screen, and we are up today, half percent, $29. Very, very nice indeed. Um, I've used leverage on it, uh, margin, uh, because I've looked at it, and uh, I'm paying 3% on margin. So what I'm doing now is I'm building up now to my $100,000. That's where I want to be, to earn $10,000 a year, because I can make $10,000 a year on this one stock. This is guaranteed. Well, not guaranteed. Nothing's guaranteed, but uh, it averages 10% a year. Over all the years that this has been running, over 10% a year average. And now we've got this huge dip that I bought after all these months of dropping down. Uh, even though it's only dropped down 10% in the last three months, that's a big drop for the for the uh, S&P. So I've got myself into that now, and I'm trying to build up my, port my, my portfolio to $100,000. That's the, that's the idea. Get it to $100,000. And then 10% a year will come literally just from that. Now, I've got 10 years before I want to retire. So that gives me 10 years to grow my portfolio to 200,000. And then that will give me 20,000 a year, a year plus dividends to live on. And that, to me, seems a very, very good structured way to go. So there we go. We're up 6% today, $2,000, 36,000 again. Heading up, up to, heading up to 40,000. So VU is now, uh, let's have a look at it. VU is now up nearly 1% today. Tesla is firing off 4.85. This is fantastic. I bought, I, I bought, I sold, I, I bought now uh, lower, lower uh, average cost now for, um, I've got seven shares, 822. Now this could go to 1,200, 1,400 before much, before much longer. So uh, great position there with Tesla. I've sold all my Bitcoin. I got my money back. I've sold it all. I've sold it all. Uh, I made some money on Bitcoin, but I'm out now. Uh, my Ethereum, my Ethereum, I've set it. I'm, I'm down 700 bucks with Ethereum, and I've set it to sell when it hits 
the 700. I don't even need to make a profit. I just want to get my money out. Okay, I'm taking my money out of crypto right now and moving it much more into dividends and uh, the uh, the index, S&P 500 index. I know it's boring, but uh, that's now I've made some money. That's what I want to do with it. Virgin Galactic is up 3.26 today. So I'm making money with Virgin Galactic, 760, same thing. Got a really, really, really low average now. This is going to go to 50, 60, 100 bucks. And what a great way to go from 760, right? Uh, Amazon today is up as well. Uh, I'm still down 3.5%, but it's moving up again. Twitter has moved up today, uh, 1.76. Very, very good. I'm happy with that. So that's very, very good indeed. Uh, hi, I'm back. Official Grow, how are you today? Alex Hunt is giving me all the likes over there on TikTok. I'll, I'll come in and join you. There we go. I'm, I'm doing the likes myself, look. There you go. I'm tapping the screen myself now to try and play a part in that. All right. <laughs> if Alex is going to do it, I'm going to do it. Look, Alex Hunt and uh, coming up. Does it show I'm coming up on there? I'm actually doing it. I'm tapping my own. I'm tapping my own likes on my other other account. Hey everyone, I'm awake. Bill's awake. He's been eating uh, Kentucky Fried Chicken today with uh, Melinda's ghost pepper sauce, and he wrote them a letter telling them how much he loved it. And now they're going to send him some free stuff. Can you believe it? <laughs> Silver membership certainly pays. Uh, like he said, it certainly does. It certainly does. That's what it's all about, right? We want your membership to make you money, and that's how it's been priced. That's how it's set up. All right, I passed out after eating KFC with Melinda's sauce. Uh, <laughs> that's very funny. I like that. Um, all right, Palantir is up today, 0 0.09. Facebook Meta is up today. Uh Let's have a look. Meta, yep, that's up today 3% as well. Very, very good. Still down 15% though. GGPI is up. I've only got one share of it right now though. Lucid has had an almighty day. At one point, it was up... Um, hang on a minute. At one point, it was up 2.5%. In fact, more than that. Yeah, 2.5%. 3.5%. Uh, 23.94%. Yep, look at that was up fantastic today. It's still up. It's still up. Still up. It's still up. So uh, today's return is 5.96. Uh, so 6% uh, today. Absolutely awesome. Look at it. It's flying. Let me refresh that. I don't think that's reading proper. Let me refresh that. Beg your pardon. Looking at that chart, I didn't look, didn't, didn't look right to me. And uh, that's better. Up 6%. It was as high, there we go, it was as high as 10. Looking at that, thinking that's odd. CEI got banged up. Yep, CEI, all speculative gambling stuff, right? Made money, now get out of it. It's, uh, at the end of the day, like I said, it's a, it's a, it's a joke company. It uh, hasn't filed its reports. It's got lots of lawsuits against it. We only bought into it because it could make money because of the oil crisis. It's not one to stay in. It's purely gambling, purely speculative. Uh, but uh, I'm now moving out of that sort of stuff. Um, S&P 500 doing well. Let's go back to uh, Gore's Cook and I'm Lucid. We got far as Hood. Here we go. Robin Hood is up nearly 4% today. Very, very nice indeed. Palatin. Uh, PayPal is also up today, nearly 3%. Still down 17% though. My, my highs were at 58,000, remember. This portfolio is nowhere near that right now. On has done 7% today. Rolls-Royce is up today, nearly 6%. Um, still 5% down, though. Let's get, uh, let's get it straight. Long way to go. Boeing, uh, we've got 45 minutes before the after hours as well. Uh, what about Apple? Apple has moved up as well today. Uh, pretty good. Uh, what about Google? Google today has returned. I'm still down 1.5%. But I bought it at the dip, but obviously it went lower. Like, like everything, you're chasing the dips. Uh, I am good. I was going to give you a gift, but I have no more coins. Ah, oh, official grow. Well, thank you very much indeed for, for even uh, considering supporting my channel. If you really want to help me and support me, uh, click the profile link just here. Just here, look. And you'll find my uh, YouTube link. It's right behind the Instagram icon on the profile of TikTok. That's where my real traders are. That's where that's where, where we're doing this show, where you can see everything. All right, come and join me over on YouTube. All right, thanks for the follow, Lee Shaw. Uh, and tomorrow is my birthday, and my aim is 
I've never had a hundred people live watch me on YouTube. It's much harder to get people on YouTube because the, the value is greater. Uh, TikTok, sometimes you can have a few thousand. Uh, but on YouTube, if you can get a hundred people watching you live, it's a big deal. So tomorrow on my birthday, I'm trying to get that. And uh, we're running a poll right now. What's the poll? The poll is... So who's joining me in the morning? Have you shared tomorrow's video to get 100 live viewers? Nine votes, 100%. Wow, 100% vote. Right, so if, if you've said you shared the video, don't lie. Here is, here is the video to share it. There it is. There's the video. I'll give it three times in the chat so you can see it. One, two, three. There's the video. This is the video live in 17 hours. Uh, we've got 11 likes on it right now. See it there? Look, 11 likes. So go and uh, share the video. Click share, which is just there. And uh, give it a thumbs up. Try and, uh, and, and uh, like the video. Everything we can do to try to get 100 people to watch live. I don't think there's any chance in hell. Honestly, I really don't. I'm not just saying that. I really don't. Okay? Because it's just, it would be ridiculous numbers compared to where we are right now. Anyway. Uh, Bitcoin is 38. I sold out of it today. Uh, I, I got all my money out. Uh, Ethereum, we're waiting for Ethereum to go up. Uh, 16%. That's where Ethereum needs to go so I can get my uh, money out of that. That's basically what I'm trying to do. Mike Flynn, how are you, Mike? Thank you for all the likes over there on uh, on TikTok. Thank you so much indeed. And Papa Stan joined. Lee Shaw just followed me. Thanks ever so much indeed. You see my position on here? There's my Ethereum. Go back to our main Bitcoin, our main position. We're up 5.5% today, 36,000. Uh, hello, mate. How's your day uh, been doing today? What happened to Apple today? Uh, what about it? Got the new product out. Let's have a look at the news. Apple unveils 5G versions of iPad and, uh, and low-end iPhone SE. Yeah, it's not the new iPhone uh, 14, though. That's probably why. Um, nothing great to talk about, really, is there? April 28th is our next earnings report for Apple. But right now, look, uh, it's, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's, it's up slightly. I'm down overall, though, on Apple, though. Uh, Alex Dorber. Alex, how, you, how are you, mate? Lovely to have you here. Over there on TikTok, lovely to have you with me today. Thanks for the follows. Thanks for joining me. All right, let's go back to our uh, live position. We've got just uh, 40 minutes to go before the bell goes, and I'm not, I'm not buying anything now. I'm not trading anything right now. Nothing, nothing going on right now. Shall we go and check some breaking news? We've got uh, the President Zelensky talking here. Let's uh, listen in. Here we go. Heard in silence by the Prime Minister and hundreds of MPs. A translation in their headsets. I would like to remind you of the words the United Kingdom has heard before and are important again. We will not give up and we will not lose. We will fight at sea and in the air. We will continue fighting for our land, whatever the cost. Invoking the eloquence of Shakespeare and the fortitude of Churchill, it was a plea for help unlike any other heard in this chamber. I am grateful to you, Boris. Please increase the pressure of sanctions. Please recognise Russia as a terrorist state. Please make sure our Ukrainian skies are safe. Please make sure you do what needs to be done and what is stipulated by the greatness of your country. In his response, Boris Johnson promised to deliver what's needed, but no sign of the military action the president asked for. We will employ every method that we can diplomatic, humanitarian and economic, Mr Speaker, until Vladimir Putin has failed in this disastrous venture and Ukraine is free once more. Ukrainians in Britain please their president's voice as being heard here. I'm incredibly proud. Uh, that there we go. Absolutely great. And if you heard as well, in, uh, very recently, only in the last few hours, um, Poland via other countries, are now sending in MiGs, okay? We are going to have a NATO country giving, uh, giving Ukraine pilots NATO planes. So the tide is turning, but the question now remains, what will be Vladimir's um, 
response to that because that could, his threat was, if we get involved, it's third world war. But many people already say we are already at a third world war. We've not just not addressed it yet. So what do you think? What do you think? Will Vladimir Putin say, okay, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's a Russian, it's, um, it's, Vlad it, it's Ukrainian planes or pilots or whatever, that's okay, we're not at war with you, NATO, or will he go, hang on a minute, you gave all your planes to us, that means, um, you know, we're at war with you, I don't know. That will remain to be seen, but once uh, I'm stocking up in food, <laughs> once that starts, uh, then everything is on the table. Everything is on the table. We then could have a third world war. Some people now are saying we, it's already begun. We just haven't accepted it yet. Uh, poor Vlad. Hope he doesn't cry. Yeah, uh, uh, Vladimir Putin is all by himself. He's only got one friend. Mr. Xi from China, it's really, oh, and uh, the, the guy from Venezuela and, and um, Eritrea, bankrupt uh, and uh, terrorist states. That's it. The rest of the world, not interested. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's a terrifying stuff right now. And, uh, but we are, we are pushing forward. Massive amounts of U.S. Mi missiles got sent and shipped today. There we go. Nudget budget move. It just said massive amounts of U.S. missiles got sent and shipped today. So there we go. Now, will he say, is Ukraine fighting me? Or will he say, hang on a minute, this is coming from the whole world. Ah, oh, poor old Vlad. The whole world's fighting Russia. The whole world. Well, you decided to go in and invade a country and bomb everybody and bomb schools and, and bomb, bomb churches and bomb hospitals. Have you seen all that, guys? Have you seen all that? He's been bombing churches and schools and hospitals. All these kids in hospital and he bombed, he bombed the school. I mean, and the, the hospital as well. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. And how can you possibly sell that to your, uh, to your people? They obviously don't know what's going on, right? Uh, anyway, looking at our stocks right now, keeping the stocks up here on the screen so you can see what's going on. Good afternoon, Martin Redding. Uh, he better hope China doesn't turn their backs on him once uh, the shit is a fan. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's, it's his only friend. I can't even believe, I can't even believe China can be so stupid to be involved either, to be quite honest. How can you, st how can you, I mean, it's right there. Right. Okay, 92% now. We've got uh, 12 votes. 11 are joining me. One's not. It's always get one person every day. We've got... Oh, by the way, did you see this morning? We had, uh, we had spoof uh, people coming into our show. Uh, it's the Reddit Army. Sorry, the Reddit Army from... Um, what do you, what'd you call it? The Sheba Army. The Sheba Army, they're so flipping tough that they do nothing, say nothing... Just come in and pretend to be other people. That's what they do. They're no flipping army at all. What happened this morning? We had someone come in. Uh, the, the day trader fan. He used my picture. He used my picture as his uh, as his icon, as his emoji, if you like. And uh, came in and said, "You're losing subscribers." No, I wasn't. All that happened was he and his mate, him and his army, they subscribed to the channel and then unsubscribed to make a point. Absolutely ridiculous. And uh, nobody else unsubscribed. It was just him. Uh, him and his mate, and uh, it's a Sheba army, because I've got people now on YouTube and, and uh, TikTok and uh, Sheba making spoof videos, saying everything here isn't real and it's a fraud and all the rest of it, so it's quite entertaining, we quite enjoy it, we don't mind, we couldn't care less, quite honestly. Uh, good afternoon. Um, the great thing about it is every time he comes in and subscribes and unsubscribes and watches videos, he, he has to watch an ad, so he gives me a cent. And also, YouTube will then suggest the video because he watched it last time. It's brilliant. I love it. Uh, DeSantis called Putin an, auth an authoritarian gas station attendant. Uh, what is that? I don't know what that means. DCU said DeSantis called, called Putin an, oh, sorry, called an authoritarian gas station attendant. Oh, I see. <laughs> A gas station attendant. Yeah, that's quite funny. I'll give you that. Now, in, that, in, that, in the poll, I said... Have you all shared the video? So here's the video. We're trying to get 100 people to watch the show tomorrow live. Right? I've got no chance, but I keep sharing it. Right? There it is. So what you have to do is like the video and give it a share. Share it with everybody you know. Text. You can When you click share, by the way, look, you can also do uh, things like... Um, 
Look, you can do uh, text because you can get the link of the video. I don't know if you knew that before, but you can get the link of the video and text people. There's so many ways you can do it, but uh, it's a bit of fun. I don't think anyone will. And but we had it. We decided today that we will. I will drink on the show. I will. I will have a bit of a laugh and get drunk on the show. And what we said we would do is, um, if I got if I got super chats to take another drink or take another shot, I will. One day of the year, I'll do it. All right. On my birthday, we'll do it. All right, that's uh, going to be qu quite funny. Thanks for the follow, uh, Bemil. Thank you ever so much. Dav Kirk joined, user 902. Thanks ever so much for joining. All the trades are here on YouTube. Uh, join us if you want to be on YouTube. All right, Evgo is up. One of our uh, electric uh, charging uh, s services, Evgo, is up 9% today. I'm still out of the money, but uh, I've got 60 shares in it. Uh, it's pretty good. I'm happy with that. Um, but uh, the big move today... The big move today is I have used my margin. I've decided to use my margin. Look, I've used it to buy um, to buy VU because I want to underpin my portfolio with a solid investment of VU, and I think uh, it, it, it's a good it's a good idea because you pay three percent APR to earn an average of ten between ten and sixteen percent. It makes perfect sense to me, so that's what I've done today. Loved Evgo, Association of Bubbles. <laughs> is is uh, Mr. Michael Bublé in the house, by the way. This is Michael Bublé, in case anyone doesn't realise. This is Michael Bublé. There we go. Loved Evgo, uh, loved Evgo today. Yes, indeed. Brilliant. Uh, Tesla is up nearly 4% today and holding. Now we've got half an hour to go before the bell goes. What is everybody doing? Let's get, a, let's, um, get an update on everyone's position right now. But... Uh, First, we need first. First thing we need to do is make sure everyone subscribed and liked the video, because not ev not all of you done that. Let's go back and look at the birthday video right now. Let's have a look. It's got twelve likes on it now. Twelve. All right. We need as many likes on this video as there are in today's show. That's kind of the deal, right? I reckon. Uh, let's have a look. Let's go back to the main screen and uh, let's have a look. All right. Here we go. Got to have a quick word from our sponsors. Wanting SPC to go uh, up a heck a lot of a lot now. <laughs> All right, be right back in 10 seconds from now. There we go. Dropped in an ad for you. Volume came in to HYMC Fusion uh, 301. HYMC, thank you for that. Good stuff. Let's go back and look at uh, SPCE. I believe a bubble was just mentioning it. Uh, SPCE, Virgin Galactic. We're up now, 2.11. I'm okay with that. Let me change the uh, resolution there on TikTok. There we go. Thank you, Alex, for the likes. Did you say VU? Yes, VOO, um, VOO. Here it is. I'll bring it on the screen for you. Let me, let me show you. Yes, here it is. This is, this is it. I've done my calculations and you pay 3% APR on Robinhood to use margin, okay? And with my account, I'm not, not a, a chance I'll get a margin call. Not a chance. My portfolio would have to drop to $25,000 to raise a margin call. So that's, not, that's no way that's going to happen. No way whatsoever, all right? And I think now we've had three months of drops. We're going to start to see an improvement. So there's no way that's going to happen. So that's the first thing. Second thing is, on average, since the beginning of time, VU has earned on average 10%. Most, uh, some years, last few years, 16%, 17%, stuff like that. So if you're paying 3% to, to uh, use, use uh, margin and you're earning 10%, now some people would say it's not worth the bother. It's not worth the bother. Uh, I, I think it is worth the bother. If I can make 7% a year without any stress whatsoever, it seems to make sense as, a, as an underpin to my overall portfolio to give my portfolio a nice solid grounding. I think it's a great idea. Uh, Yonig, uh, thanks for the follow. Uh, Lofra, thanks for the follow. Alex Hunt is over there banging away at the uh, likes. He's made me want to do it, so I'm going to do it as well. There we go, here we go. I'm going to bang on the likes as well now. So uh, there we go. So I bought in today and uh, we, uh, uh, Vanguard was up. Uh, VU was as high as uh, 
At one point, it was as high as 1.64. It's just gone a bit flat right now, but that's the thing. It won't do masses amounts, but over the year, it'll, it'll rise between 10 16%, and that's okay. That's kind of what we want, right? And if I've got 10 15 20% of my portfolio in that, then 20% of my money is earning 10 15% a year. The rest is going to come on profits, uh, high-risk stocks. That, to me, seems not a bad idea. Uh, you bought space today. Let's have a look. Uh, I purchased space at 741. Very nice. My average now is at 757. I have 1,001 uh, there. Made a quick profit on Camber Energy this morning and now have 50 shares at no cost and put 40 in my pocket. Uh, Martin Redding, I like that. I like that. Very, very good indeed. All right. Okay. Let's... Uh, Get everyone's, we're going to do a day trade of the day again today, right? 12 likes now on the video for the morning. Have, has everyone shared it? I asked you the question. Are we going to, are you going to be here and are you going to share the video? So there you go. There are 16 of you watching right now. So we need 16 likes on this video. It's tomorrow's show. And, and I've said I will for one, one day only, once a year, I will drink on the show for fun. I, I will not trade. I will not buy anything or sell anything, but I, I will play drinking games. So as we, uh, as you, as you do uh, stuff in the chat, I will take a swig of a beer or whatever it might be. All right, we'll 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 have a bit of fun with that. We'll see, we'll see how that goes. All right, we'll see how that goes in the in the morning. Uh, it should be a bit of fun, okay? And. Uh, <laughs> See how it goes. I may never do it again. Uh, thank you for the follow, Rec2022. Uh, Mike Walber, thanks for the follow. Yonig, thanks for the follow. Hey, guys, over on TikTok, you're doing a great job. Appreciate it much indeed. Here's my stocks. You can see it on the screen here now. Uh, my, this is all my money in all the world, other than five grand in the bank to pay the, um, the, daily, you know, the daily bills. This is all my money right here. And I've grown it from $5,000 in seven months live on the show. Mike's just joined in as well on TikTok. What's your tipple? Uh, I like it. I like, I, like a, I like a nice whiskey. I like a nice beer, you know, like a Budweiser or whatever. A, a, a tribute ale in Cornwall, pro where, I, where I'm from. A proper real ale, room temperature. I like a Bailey's. I like a few things, right? And sometimes a little glass of red wine with a bit of cheese. Who, who, doesn't, who doesn't have a bit of cheese with a bit of red wine? Uh, what are you doing there? What are you doing there? What sort of question is that? Um, Thomas, T Thomas, Tommy S. Vev Dory says, what are you doing there? What am I doing here? I'm in my house. I mean, what am I doing here? What's, <laughs> what do you think I'm doing? I get some funny questions on TikTok. I really do. Uh, anyway, Canva Energy's fallen back down now. I'm not in it anymore now. McDonald's is pulled back. No surprise, McDonald's now is pulling out of uh, Russia. Now, I don't know how long. Bailey's is for, is for coffee, LOL. Hey, I love Bailey's. Brandy, whiskey, I love, I love all that. Bailey's is great. I don't have it with ice either. If you have it with ice, you ruin it. I don't know what people do when they have ice. All right, flipping ridiculous. I like a nice cup of tea uh, and Chinese tea. No alcohol for me. I can't drink much. I get drunk really quick. I don't like a headache either. Sent you an email link. You sent me an email link. What's that mean then? Am I supposed to open it? Am I? You know what happened to the what happened to the old-fashioned ways? Hi Martin, how are you? This is Alex here. I just sent you. I just sent you an email. Maybe check it out. No, we don't do that anymore. We don't do niceties anymore. We just go sent you an email link. <laughs> sent you an email link. U.S. sending, oh, here we go, U.S. sending lethal, hang on. Yeah, that was, it came up with somebody else. Here we go. Here we go, is Alex Hunt. Alex just sent me this. Alex sent me this on TikTok, you ready? Uh, Bailey's and Tia Maria to get, oh, lovely. Here we go. Including Air Force C-17s landing at an airstrip about an hour away from where we're standing. That aircraft you see there, that is the type that's been carrying Javelin anti-tank missiles and Stinger anti-aircraft missiles, which then make their way over the border into Ukraine to help the Ukrainian fight against the Russians. And we also saw on the way to this location this morning, a convoy of U.S. Of, of military vehicles with boxes with U.S. markings on them. They too were headed toward the border. 
As for the fighting itself, this morning there's another attempt at a ceasefire. We like the sound of that, but there were failed attempts over the weekend, which once again left civilians forced to shelter to avoid Russian shelling. The U.S. is sending not only humanitarian aid, but also lethal weaponry. And we have seen some of it moving through Poland just today. Multiple giant aircraft, including Air Force C-17s, landing at an airstrip about an hour away from where we're standing. That aircraft you see there, that is the type that's been carrying javelin. There you go. That was just sent in uh, via Alex. Thank you ever so much, Alex. Uh, even though I was giving him a hard time about uh, everything, I was going, hey, what, what's, hap what's happening? But <laughs> he knows I'm only kidding. But uh, anyway, that was sent in from Alex. Thank you ever so much indeed. Oh, hello. The day trader fans here. The day trader fan. <laughs> One of my Shiba Army guys is in, is in the house. He'll subscribe to me, then unsubscribe, and then tell me my subscriber count's going down. Here he is. The day trader fan. He's got my picture. Look, look at that. He's been on the, He's been on YouTube and found it. Let me put it on the screen. The day trader fan. I love it. Absolutely love it. We were talking earlier, day trader fan. You said a few things and then you disappeared. I want you. I want you to come back and answer the questions. I love it. I've made you famous now. I'll put you on the screen. In fact, you're on YouTube. You're on TikTok, Facebook. Uh, you're also you're on TikTok, Facebook, YouTube, multiple websites. So uh, everything you say. Is all here for the world to see. So do do your best. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I really do. Uh, anyway, fantastic. Uh, let's go back into uh, our sh our uh, sh stocks for the minute. Here we go. Let's bring this up. Uh, let's see if we can find some information here. I want to share with everybody. Here we go. All right, there we go. Uh, it's your show. <laughs> yes, it is. Shall we? Shall we invite? Shall we invite the day trader fan? He's got. See, he's got. He's, he's got his. Uh, he's got his asterisk. He's got his little little things now. Sheba, blow up Sheba. Yeah, this is the Sheba army. Look, see, the army, the Sheba army. They're all. Uh, they're, they're they're all talking nonsense on. Uh, it's my show, Mike. Apparently, in fact, it's not your show anymore because as of this moment, I'm going to ignore everything you say. All right, brilliant. So that's ended your show. Yeah, shall I invite him to join? Shall we? Shall we see if he's if he's a real army? Let's see if he joins. It's only two bucks a month. Let's see if he, let's see if he invests two dollars two dollars a month to be a member. I'm guessing not, but there we go. We'll give him the invitation. Um, anyway, I'm not going to reply to you anymore. But we gave you a moment of fame. I hope you enjoyed it, but uh, I'm not going to do it anymore because you're enjoying it too much, and I don't want you to. I don't want you to enjoy it. I want him to enjoy poking fun at you. Right. Okay. So here we go. 35 at 759. Uh, we are up today. 3.44. We're up 3.44. Whatever you do, don't invest in Sheba unless you want it as a lottery ticket. It's purely gambling. Complete waste of time. Uh, join, join, join. <laughs> He won't join. He won't join. He'll talk nonsense and say silly stuff, and he won't. He's got no intention of joining and being part of anything. He just wants to have a laugh, talk nonsense. Anyway, let's. Uh, oh, hang on a minute. What's happening to my uh, YouTube feed? Let's have a look. Let's play that a minute. There we go. Let me play that. Close player and uh, upcoming live streams. On the TV, our TV screen. Let me update the TV screen. Play that, and click play. There we go. That's better. Skip the ad. I've got ads playing now on my own show. Look at that. Let's skip that. There we go. That's better. Sorry about that, TikTokers. You were getting the uh, ads come up, but we got rid of it for you. We fixed it now. All good. Let's go back into the main screen again. Okay. Evgo. Um, <laughs> flipping idiot. Right. Where are we now? Evgo. Evgo's there. Uh, Camber Energy has now come down. We've uh, got out of that now. We're no longer in that. McDonald's is down, is just starting to move down very, very slightly. Uh, SoFi is just is up actually 1.61. Uh, 
Uh, Vanguard is now just flat. Believe a bubble, you need risk assessment, risk assessments to be on Martin's show tomorrow. Yes, you do. You need a risk assessment. <laughs> yeah, basically, I'm going to be drinking all day on the show. It's going to be quite fun. And... Uh, and um, then we're going to go for a nice, nice steak meal. My wife taking me for a nice steak meal. So there we go. Uh, I'm going to I'm going to share this post. It's not coming through, but I'll show it. I'll sh I'll share your comment. There we go. Because comments are good for the channel. Uh, there we go. Uh, did you hear the Russians are attacking Spotify and shutting it down? At least that's the Reddit rumor. Uh, Martin, did you hear that the Russians are? <laughs> Happy birthday from the Sheba army. There we go. Brilliant. Tesla is up three is up 3.3. Three. Uh I think that Ma Martin might need the uh the RA. What's the RA? I think uh, Martin might need the RA. What's the RA? <laughs> risk. Oh, risk. Oh, yeah. You think I'll need the risk assessment? <laughs> yeah. I'll need a risk assessment to be on my own show. Yeah, probably. No doubt about that. No doubt about that. Martin Redding, we took over. Uh, we took over Reddit. Yeah, I bet, I bet you did. I bet you did. <laughs> it's amazing what you can do from behind your keyboard, isn't it? Uh, Virgin Galactic is now up 1.38. Who was the Algo fan? Oh, yeah. Do you remember that? Oh, my gosh. That was funny, wasn't it? The Algo fan. You're talking about um, Algo, block uh, uh, Algo blockchain. Oh, God. Yeah, that was ridiculous. He got really angry when he couldn't understand. Uh, he, he couldn't understand um, <laughs> why, why I wasn't interested in investing in, Al in, um, in Algo blockchain. Ar Argo blockchain, wasn't it? Argo. Spotify is having uh, access problems. Smash the like button. Yeah, subscribe and ring the bell. Smash the like button. There you go. Um, we've got 15 minutes to go. Yeah, we need 20 likes because tomorrow, tomorrow, I, I tell you what, Mr. Um, Mr. Uh, Sheba Army, tomorrow we're going to have, it's my birthday party, right? And uh, w with your army, you could get 100 people to watch the show and take over the show tomorrow if you uh, have, have got the power of an army. Tomorrow's my birthday, and, and I'm going to be drinking during the show. Once a year, I'm going to drink, and as we get um, as we get people in the live chat, make suggestions, uh, I, I'm going to I'm going to drink in, the, in live in the show. I'm not going to trade, though. I'm not going to suddenly lose all my money. But uh, tomorrow, live on the show, I'm going to be here all day, drinking all day, doing silly stuff, and um, it's going to be quite a laugh. So if you want to come and uh, jump all over it, be our guest tomorrow because we want 100 people in the show. We've never done it before, but tomorrow will be the first time. Be a lot of fun. I don't think there's any chance in hell it's going to happen. I certainly don't think you, you and your army can make any difference, but uh, you're very welcome to try. Uh, McDonald's is down 0.24. So far it is up 0.51. We've got 15 minutes to go. What does everybody think? Right, we've now got 13 likes now on the video. I mean, no Spotify, end of the world, eh? I know. Can you believe it? <laughs> here is, um, here is the, uh, the, the link for the video tomorrow. Uh, there it is. There is the link for the video. If you want to leave a like on it, there's the link for the video. Now, I've asked you in the poll, have you liked, are you going to be here? Have you shared the video? And uh, it says... 16 vote, which means 14 of you. So that's that's right, because there's 13 likes. So as always, you're always telling the truth. That's good. That's what we want. All right, there is the... Uh, there it is. There it is. There is the link in the chat. Uh, okay, let me go back to the trades and see what we're doing. Uh, let's have a look. You will get, I'll get 32 people. Yeah, we'll get 30 because we do that always. We always get that many people anyway. Uh, that's a challenge a day trader fan. Take him up on it. He won't do it. He won't do it. He's, it it's him and his mate is an army. The Sheba army is about three people on Reddit who just talk nonsense every day and no one's listening. Um, anyway, 
Get all your Shiba Army to sub to the Day Trader channel. For everyone that joins, Martin will drink a shot. Yeah, I will. For everyone, any, any one of your army tomorrow that turns up, I will drink a shot. All right? If you get people in tomorrow, I will drink a shot every time. All right? I will do that. I'll get him drunk then by 10,000 in the Shiba. He will then be a... Sh yeah. <laughs> So my HYMC, it should go straight up now. That's what normally happens, Fusion. Shall we have a look at HM HMYC for you? Let's do it. Let's do it for you. Let's, let's do it. Uh, okay, here we go. HYMC. Let's have a look. Is this the one? Highcroft Mining. Very, a lot of volatility here. If you can't connect with Spotify or Discord, then no, it's not, just, it's not just you or your internet connection. Both services acknowledge problems on Tuesday afternoon. We love Fusion. Uh, he's one of us. Is he? Fusion's a great bloke. Fusion's brilliant. He's not one of anybody. He's himself. He's here every day. He's a brilliant person. So my HYMC, so it should go straight up now. Yeah, that's probably what's going to happen. That's probably what's going to happen. That's what happened to me, didn't it, when I, with um, Camber Energy, and then the other one, the uh, Humor, Humor, whatever it was, Houston, uh, Houston Electricity, yeah. I was chasing it all day. Don't, uh, don't chase it. Don't chase a stock like that. Up 206% today. God, can you imagine if you bought this this morning and you put $100 on it? You'd be up, you'd up, you'd be up 200 bucks, you'd be up to $300. It's like insane, isn't it? Absolutely incredible. Um, does anyone know anything about SG stocks? I'll oh, go on. I'll, I'll make this day trader fan famous. Look, there we go. There we go. <laughs> Come and get your Shiba. Come and get your rubbish. Um, anyway, I've just, I tell you what, I've sold all my Bitcoin today as well. Now, Bitcoin is a real investment, but I've sold it all today. And uh, I've made my money on it and I'm out for a while. Uh, ping pong, ping, ping pong. Keith Chegwin, how are you? How are you? Uh, Kyber Network. I could you tell me what you do, please? I know I'm, I'm new on this. Uh, Leonard. Good morning, Leonard. Let me address you over on TikTok. If what you're seeing right now is my real life savings, right? This is my real money. I started with five thousand dollars, and I've grown it to fifty-eight thousand live on YouTube in front of everyone. It's my real money, my real trades. Uh, I'll show you my TV studio. This is my TV studio coming up now, behind me. You'll see on the screen behind me. I was voted by Elton John as the world piano man. All right, I'm an entertainer. I've traveled 195 countries. That's what I do, and I'm investing my life savings. But unlike other YouTubers and other people on Reddit who talk a load of nonsense to influence stuff to get you to watch their channel, I couldn't, I couldn't care less. I just love my family that join me every day on this channel. What you're seeing right now is my real money, my real trades, and real traders who join me every day. If you want to be on YouTube, click the profile. It's right here. Wow, we got five, we got 6,000 likes. We've got 6,000 likes, everybody, on TikTok. It's like an all-time record. Absolutely amazing. If you uh, click here, you'll find the YouTube, the YouTube link right behind the Instagram icon. Don't ask me why Twitter, uh, Inst uh, uh, TikTok do that. They just do. Thanks for all the follows, everybody. Rosa, thanks for the follow. Trevor, thanks for the follow. Awesome. And if you come over and join us on YouTube, all right, you'll see all my trades like, like you can see here. And I will share with you some free stock. I have some free crypto to give away because my sponsors give me stuff and I just give it to you. So if you want some free stock, some free crypto, and you want to talk to all my traders live here in the show, we have some seriously big angel investors. Peru Invest, we have who join us every day, gives us great tips. Uh, also, we have... Um, we have uh, Muzanella. We have great, uh, the market profit. We have amazing, amazing tra uh, traders. Uh, bought coffee with Shiba today. Well, that's an achievement. I'm glad you shared that with us, mate. Uh... <laughs> God, you don't need me to make you sound silly. You do it yourself. I, bu I bought coffee today with Shiba. Brilliant. I need to buy some more Shiba so I can get a cup of coffee. <clears throat> I love it. I love it. The Shiba Army are brilliant. They make me laugh. They attack me everywhere. Make silly videos. Uh, edit the videos. Turn them up to down. Inside. I feel like Donald Trump. 
I'm as famous as Donald Trump. Donald Trump gets videos made about him. So does the, so does Martin Lucas from The Day Trader. It's quite entertaining. Virgin Galactic is up 1% today. Amazon is now dropping back slightly. Uh, Twitter is up 1% today. NVIDIA is up now 1.33%. Uh, yes, it's Starbucks, it's cheap. We are family. Got all my sisters with me. We are family. Get up, everybody, and sing. We are family. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Right, 10 minutes to go. Let's do day trader of the day, shall we? We'll do it in 10 minutes. See who's made the most money. I know who it won't be. It won't be our guy on Sheba. It won't be him. He'll, he'll, be, he'll be in last place. But anyway, Mike166A. Welcome to Mike 166A. Let's see if everyone's liked the video yet. Difference between you and Trump. You tell the truth. Trump has no concept. <laughs> uh, open a short on Tesla. That's a good idea. Yeah, you do that. Brilliant. Because when you lose your money, it'll go up again. Brilliant. I love it. Keep doing it. I'm green today. What, with your with Sheba? I don't think so. Um, anyway. Let's carry on. We're up now 2.89, 35,574. Brilliant stuff. Now, the plan is today, what I've done is I've used my margin because it's 3% on Robinhood. It's increased from 2.5% to 3%. And that, to me, makes sense if I can, in, if I can make a 10% minimum every year on VU. That, to me, makes sense. So I'm not using margin just to buy anything Tom, Dick, and Harry. I'm using it to buy my VU. So that's what I'm doing today. All right, I've done that. Bitcoin is now trading sideways. I've sold my position on Bitcoin uh, and Ethereum. I want it to go up uh, 17%, and then I will sell it all. I will sell my, I, I, I'm not looking to make a profit on Ethereum. I'm just waiting to get my money back. And if it gets close to it, I'll sell it anyway. I don't even, I don't care. Because right now, this is my theory. I believe in crypto, right? But the rest of the world doesn't. Because, and here's the reasons why. If Bitcoin, Ethereum, all, all the real coins, all the real crypto was going to make big money, and I'm not saying it won't in the future, I don't know. But right now, with the corruption in, in Russia, with banks shutting down, with people fearful of everything, this was the best time ever, ever, in, since crypto ever came out, for crypto to, to like, take off. Now, we were, we, we were told, oh, it's going to do 100,000 by the end of the year. I thought it was going to. I thought it would. But it, not, it hasn't happened. People have not gone all in on crypto, even though I'm totally, I totally believe it could. Remember, the only reason why it will go up is because of greed. The only reason why any any asset goes up is because people buy it and they think it's going to go up. If people aren't buying it, it won't go up. People aren't buying it now. And now is the best time ever for it to go up. And it's not going up. If it was go if, if people were buying it, it'd be going up. All right? So my honest feeling on it right now is if it was going to go up, this is now the time. This is now the time. So I think it still could go to 100,000. It could go to a million. But the reason why I don't think it's going to go there now or anytime soon is because all the reasons for it to go up are in place and no one's buying in. No one's buying in. So, and I've got the money. I've put it all, I've put it on the, the S&P 500. I've put it on Tesla. I've put it on Rivian. I've put it on Microsoft, Apple. Would the market turn green? Would the market turn green in the next seven minutes? We are green today. Uh, I'm down forty six percent in total from my investment. Yeah, I've sold. I've sold it all. I'm not trying to influence you or manipulate you in any way. Whatever you do, what you like. Uh, but I have sold my position of Bitcoin, and I've also I'm 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 trying to get out of um, Ethereum. And I'm giving away my bit, um, my Sheba, the bit of Sheba that I have that was given to me. I give it away every Friday. Every Friday to the members, you know, you know when I give away a cash prize, it comes out of my Sheba. Every Friday, I just give it away. Give it away all the time. I love crypto as it generates me a stable income. 
I've always said it's my most stable asset. It is. Bitcoin was my most stable asset. It was. It, I, I said it and I'm not changing my mind because it did it, right? But do I feel it's the best um, investment for my money right now? No, I don't. I Now I'm moving back into technology, which will improve the future and do things. And if it were, if if crypto was to do was 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 uh, there for the future now, uh, it would be moving. But it's not. It isn't. Nothing's happening. Um, people are frightened at the moment, and people genuinely use resources they're used to. In this case, cold hard cash. Yeah, but listen to uh, listen listen uh, bubble. You've got all this insecurity now with, uh, with with manipulation and banks and so on and so forth. People are worried about uh, interest rates. Um, they're worried about inflation. That is what crypto was invented for, to protect against inflation, to protect against security, uh, to hedge against uh, inflation. And no one's and it's available now. You can buy cr crypto in all four corners of the globe. But yet no one, no one is on mass like they should be. So anyway, uh, thanks for the follow. Super Panda, thanks for the follow. Gracie, how are you, Gracie? Uh, Giza, how are you, Giza? Lovely to have you here. Piggy, 8666, 72Chevy, 72, how are you? Brilliant. Pineapple, lovely to see you. Tracy Moe, loads of people coming in. Tony Hudson, how are you? So there you go. DWAC going to be huge soon. Oh, my God. DWAC's going to be huge soon, is it? You're, yeah, I'm a flipping heck. I don't know where to start. Truth Social. I've got Truth Social. It's the biggest con ever so far. So far, it's the biggest con ever. It's the, it's the first app ever on, on the App Store that is released. And then when it comes out, you can't do anything with it. So far, it's been a big uh, scam to collect your email. Now, I've got three accounts set up. There's my account. Look, nothing's happening. Nothing's doing. It's just sat there doing nothing at all. And so far, all it's been is an uh, is, um, opportunity for someone to collect my email. That's all it's been. It doesn't do anything. And there's no information on their website. There's no communication from them. But they want you to invest in DWAC. It's a, it's a, it's a target. DWAC is a target for a hostile takeover to block Trump. Yeah. <laughs> DWAC is, the, is, is, is more speculative than choosing red or black in, in a casino. I've made money on DWAC. When it first popped out, I knew a lot of people would protest. People who love Trump would buy it and people who hate Trump would sell it. So I bought in. I made 100%. I sold out. Uh, there it is. Market is red. Uh, right. Today, I've moved my money into more stable stock and I'm up 2.5%. Market is red. Nicholas Morello. I feel like liberals always dip, uh, diss on Trump stuff. They don't know anything. Hey, I, I am not, I have, I can't even vote in the US. I'm a green card holder. I am not a US citizen. I'm a green card holder. I don't vote either way. I'm not, uh, I'm completely neutral. I am just looking at the facts. The facts are the app came out. Donald Trump said it would be the truthful best thing ever in the world. And for two and a half, three weeks now, it's done nothing. And there's no information, doesn't tell you when it's coming out, what's going on. There's just lots of rumors about March. And there's never been an app on the App Store ever, and I've checked, that came out and did nothing. It's the first one. And um, Donald Trump, I believe, has had, I think it's seven bankrupt businesses. And this will be another one. The facts are Trump was better for the U.S. I'm not going to get into politics. I'm not going to get into that. I'm just talking about the app. I'm just talking about the app. The app doesn't do anything. All right. There it is on the screen. One day it might do something, but right now it doesn't. That's all I'm saying. You should expect excellence, not, not uh, me mediocrity. And right now it's mediocrity. It's, it's, in fact, it's not even that. It's the first app on the App Store that's being threatened to be removed because it doesn't do anything. All right. There's not even a helpline or an email you can contact Truth Social and say what's going on. They don't. There's nothing there. All right. So there you go. Uh, thanks for the follow over there, James Henderson. Thank you very much indeed. Um, 
Trump was, was also uh, never on the cover of Time magazine. The one in the frame in his office was photoshopped. Is, is that right? I don't know anything about that. I don't know anything about that. I couldn't say. But if you say so, uh, I'll believe you, mate. I've got no idea. Didn't know about that one. Yeah, we're not going to, we're not, we're, we're not a political channel. We're not getting on one side of the argument or, or, or not. We're not doing that here. We're just simply pointing out facts as we see them, as they are presented to us, right? Right, the bell's gone. We're, we're after hours now. Trump, uh, Trump's buying gold like me. Uh, there you go. <coughs> the, right, the portfolio now is up on the hour and uh, we are up today, 2.43. All right, let's, let's go to your main portfolio and let's see who wins the day trade today. Put your score on the chart. I am up 2.41. I was up a lot higher than that just an hour or so ago, but uh, that's where I am now, 2.41%. See anyone beats me, up or down, up 2.41%. Put your honest trades on the screen. You've got a minute from now. Are you ready? Here comes the minute. Adam Cornfield. How are you, mate? Let's see if anybody can beat me today. Oh, Dan is up 48%. <laughs> Completely smashed it. Uh, day trade is up 4.37. 4.7. Up 1.2, DCU, 48%. We will talk to Dan in a few moments' time and find out how he's done that and what he's done for that. We'll hold that on the screen right now. That's an incredible score. Of course it is. Up 2%. I thought I'd done well today. Believe a bubble, well done. Here we go. Let's ask. We will ask him in a moment. Okay, three, two, one. Okay, here we go. So we're going to clear the board and uh, the winner tonight is Dan. Now then, let's ask Dan, what did you do for that? First of all, let's thank him for his honest trades. There we go. Thank you very much indeed. Give him a thumbs up. There you go. And uh, a big round of applause to you. Nice one. So, uh, Dan, how are you up 48%? What exactly have you done that's put you up 48%? Like to know, is that that's uh, up 55? Sean is up 55%. Uh, unfortunately, uh, unfortunately, um, Sean Musen, you were out of time. You came in after time. 50, but I want to know though, Sh Sean, 55%. Uh, Tesla short saved me midday. That's uh, from Sheba. Uh, but I want to know from uh, Dan, how are you up 48%? Jumped on the oil train and traded ticker ENSV. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at it. ENSV. ENSV. And Servco. Let's have a look. Uh, it was up 68% today. Now, I just want to be absolutely clear. The competition that we run here is for your overall portfolio, all right? Realized and unrealized gains, the whole thing. So basically, you go to your portfolio on your day position, all right, on your day position, and uh, that's the number, all right? Not just one stock, because if you buy oil, oil, oil today, you're not at 700%, you know, you know, that, that, unless that's the only stock you've got, that doesn't really count. It's, it's your overall portfolio that you invest in. All right, that's what we want to see. Uh, there we go. Oil, electric sucks. Well, that's all right. You can think that, but unfortunately, it's the future, where oil is the past, I'm afraid, but uh, you can, you're entitled to your opinion. Uh, yeah, I went all in. Well, congratulations to you. I tried it yesterday, and unfortunately, it's all about timing, uh, and I uh, entered the market at the wrong time. I set my, what do you call it? my uh, trading stop loss and I didn't time it very well and uh, I didn't allow enough of a swing. Uh, on, on, the, on the plus side, of course, it stops me from losing all my money. But on the downside, it traded, it traded out too quick and I, and, I, and, I, and I lost money on it. I made, made money on one trade, lost on the next. Uh, on, on, made money on the next, lost, on, lost again. So it was battles and forwards all day long. So uh, it, overall, I didn't make any money on it. Anyway, 
There we go. What about the guy with 55%? Yeah, let's ask him. Muzanella. Muzanella wants to know the guy with 55%. Sean Muzan. Sean Muzan. What exactly did you do? One of our biggest traders, Muzanella, who trades uh, hundreds of contracts at a time, is asking, uh, what did you do to get 55% up? What did you do? Thanks, Believer Bubble. You're very welcome. 50,000. Oh, I missed it. Oh, I missed it. Darn it. I knew uh, Bubble wouldn't let me down. 50,000 Murray. It's a trademark. 50,000 Murray. Uh, uh, right. 50,000 Murray. There he is. I can't believe I missed it. I make up for it now, though. Oh, yeah. I'm all over the chat. <laughs> the famous V. <laughs> the famous V when you go too quick. Uh, so let's have a look. Um, we haven't got an answer yet from the Sean Muzan. Sean Muzan hasn't come back with an answer. If he does, we will share it with everybody, right? But right now, we don't know the answer to that. So there we go. We're trying to find that out. Over on TikTok, I got my biggest ever audience. My biggest ever audience. 10,000. What's 10,000, uh, Alex? Yay, 10,000. What's 10,000? Alex Hunt over on TikTok is saying 10,000. What's 10,000? Over on TikTok, what's, what's there's not 10,000 likes, it's 7,000 likes. Uh, and uh, 57 watching. <laughs> what's the 10,000? 10,000 likes? It's saying 7,000. Wow. I've never got 10,000 before. We're on 7,000 right now. It's say, apparently, it's saying there's 10,000. Wow. Breaking records today. That's why, I've got, that's why I've got so many people watching the show on TikTok. Anyway, is the portfolio going to hit 50,000 tomorrow, Martin? Murray McKind, you know the answer for that. You know it's not going to hit 50,000. You know, you know it's not. It's, uh, sh it's 10 and a half thousand shows for me. Or maybe I'm a bit behind then. Maybe I'm a bit behind. It's catching up. It's, I'm, I'm seeing seven and a half, but it's going up quicker by the, by the second. Uh, anyway, so 50,000 Murray. It, uh, I don't see it happening tomorrow, my, my friend. But uh, anyway, I'm up today 2.22. I, I was up, up a lot higher. So this is what we're going to do now. We're going to... Uh, it will. <laughs> yeah. Yo, yeah. That would, that, that, wouldn't that be a day? God, can you imagine if, I, if it went from 35 to 50? That's 15 grand in a day. That would be the, that would be the biggest ever day on the stock market in the history of the world, ever. Anyway, right now, Canberra Energy is back down again. Uh, McDonald's is trading sideways. Uh, SoFi is dropping back down. VU is down today, 1%. 1 That's absolutely fine. That's what you'd expect. Uh, Tesla is up today. Uh, Rivian. Now, Rivian, I'll ask again tomorrow. <laughs> um, yeah, you do that, mate. Uh, right, right, listen, we've got some big things happening. We've got March the 10th. Is after hours Rivian Rivian earnings report. So I'm hoping tomorrow Rivian will start to pop up. And uh, if that happens, I will sell some off the top because it only has to go up a few percent and uh, it's overweighted. As you can see, my Rivian stock is 6.99%. Uh, I bought the dips. As it goes up, I'm going to sell it. Not all of it, but uh, anyway. A big day tomorrow. It's a big day tomorrow because it's my birthday. I'm 53 tomorrow and I'm going to be drinking live on the show. And uh, in the uh, in the um, and people can call in. People can call in tomorrow. You can be on the show. Uh, you can call in tomorrow. March the 16th. Be ready. Uh, what's happening on March the 16th? Have you got a crystal ball? What's happening on the 16th for fact? We only want facts. Me too. It's twenty percent of my portfolio. Uh, yes, it's too right, too much, right? You want to trim it off. You want to trim it off. So uh, anyway, there we go. 
Tomorrow, you can call in and be in this space here. If you've got a phone or a computer, you can call in. I give you a link. You don't, you don't even need, here is the link, bit.ly forward slash Martin Live. You don't need Zoom. You don't need anything at all, any technology. I'll take care of all that for you. You just put that in your browser and you can call in right there. All right. You can be live on the show tomorrow. All right. Uh, Rivian, earnings report for my hidden company. <laughs> your secret company. Brilliant. Uh, Believe a bubble. Can I call in? No, it's only for members. Sorry, mate. Only members can call in. And uh, you, you can't be a member because it costs $2. And that's worth more than your Sheba. So you, you can't call. You haven't got two bucks. I will call in tomorrow for you. There we go. Believe a bubble is going to call in. Believe a bubble's calling in. He's a member. And he's going to do a bubble routine. We're going to have live bubbles on the show tomorrow. And then we're going to make Believe a Bubble famous. Make sure that you've got some sort of YouTube channel that I can promote you on. All right. Uh, boo. Yeah, you can say boo. But you got no money. You're in Sheba. <laughs> oh, flipping heck. Ha, ha, ha. Yeah, well, he's right, isn't it? Yeah, it's right. It's right. I'm dead right what I'm saying. You don't have to believe me. You, t you, you do what you like. Uh, anyway. If you be a member, you can call in. If you've just got to become a member, and I can't stop you from calling in because I do it for all my members, here is the invitation to join. If you've got $2, you can call in tomorrow on my birthday. So there you go. If you've got all this money and you really want to call in and promote Sheba for $2, a whole $2, you could do it. Uh, good afternoon, rich people. Peru Invest. Peru Invest. We've got our, you want $2. That's all it costs. That's all it costs, because I, I, I just want to prove to everybody that you're talking nonsense, and you won't spend $2, because you haven't got it. He's a coward. Yeah, I know he won't join. Of course he won't join. Sheba Army just talk nonsense. You want $4. <laughs> that, you can be careful now, because you might bankrupt yourself with your uh, Sheba. Be careful. Don't promise what you can't afford. Um, Peru Invest is our big trader. Now, here he is, our angel investor. This is, this is, this is like... Um, David and Goliath, Peru Invest, who invests, who is, is, a, is a huge investor who gives us proper, proper trading tips. An amazing guy who, uh, as we all know, has supported the channel, given give, give me my biggest ever tip. By the way, everybody, Peru Invest paid for this screen here, this screen 300 buck tip he gave me. I'd like to introduce Peru Invest, our biggest trader, to our most ridiculous, smallest trader, and that is the day trader like Sheba. Uh, there he is. I'd like, they are both in the chat together. Look, I'd like to introduce Peru Invest to the day trader like Sheba. Uh, from the biggest to the smallest. There you go. Each other, introduce yourselves. <laughs> I'm having fun today. I don't care. Right. Let's have a look. Peru, what's your trade of the day? Great question. If Sheba keeps doing what they are doing and more, we could see 0 0.01 or more in about six years. Six years. I'm not a financial advisor, just my opinion. In about six years, you can't... Now, 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 now Muzanella... You're my friend. You're my mate. You're a serious trader. Can you seriously... We can't be talking six years away. If we've got to invest for six years on, on something like that, then I, I think I'll just go outside. I, I'd, I'd rather, I'd rather build, just, just build a house with brick by brick by myself and take six years to build it. Uh, uh, I was up higher than you. Who are you saying small? <laughs> <laughs> oh, flipping heck. Right. Let's close up the show right now. Because we're coming to the end of the show and we have to prepare for tomorrow's show. So it's, ex it's extremely difficult to invest on something called Sheba. Of course it is. And another thing as well, and I want to say this, I've never heard any of our serious 
Uh, yeah. I've never heard any serious investor, any educated individual use the word Sheba is going to the moon. No financial advisor, no bank manager, Peru, me, Muzanella, Warren Buffett, presidents of countries, I don't care. No educated financial person will ever use the word going to the moon. It sounds as stupid as it sounds. It's uneducated, absolute riffraff nonsense. So uh, if you start using that word, uh, it's ridiculous. Investing 300 in Shiba would not kill anyone. I, I agree. $300 is like, use it like buying a lottery ticket. I've done it. I've done it. You know I did. I, I think I spent, did I spend $200? No. Is it $500? Uh, I think it was $500 I spent in Shiba. And now I've been giving it away every, every week in, in the cash prizes. I couldn't care less if it goes to a million bucks. I, I just, I couldn't care less. It's, I'm not investing my money in a joke. Um, anyway, wait uh, to your brother Elon Musk. You look up to say that. What? Wait, that, that's not even good English. Wait to your brother Elon Musk. You look up to say that. Eh? I don't understand your comments. They're not even proper English. Right, let's get back to the trades. Right, we're showing up shop now. The, the vote we were doing today was uh, 18 votes. So 18 votes. I, I should have 18 likes now on this video. I've got 13. So five of you haven't liked the video. So I, I'm gonna get, we're going to end the show now. I'm back in the morning. And tomorrow I'm going to get an early night. Because in the morning, I'm going to be sitting here with my beer and my shots. All right. And then uh, when people call in and when people uh, make special requests, whatever, I will drink a, a, a shot. All right. I will drink shots, drink beer and I'll fall off my chair if necessary. I'm going to do it once a year, once a year on the day trader. It's what I'm going to do for the fun. But uh, I'm trying to get 100 people to watch live. Uh, there we go. It, it'll be fun. See what happens. 10,000 likes. Oh, yes, we have done it. 10,000 likes. I can see it now. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got a record today on TikTok. 10,000 likes. I've never had that. I've got 48 people watching. 10,000 likes. There we go. We've got to do this tomorrow. I hope you're using this as a practice, guys, because tomorrow we got... <laughs> it's going to be flat, isn't it? Right, Murray McKines. Ciao. Murray McKines is off. See you in the morning, Murray. Uh, let, let me show you. Look. This is TikTok right now, look. Uh, let, let me show you, look. This is TikTok right Three. now, look. Uh, right, there you go, look. See up the top, 10,000 likes. See it? Top left-hand corner. I am now the, I'm now the biggest TikToker in the world. All right, I have 10,000 likes. Uh, there you go. I'm the biggest TikToker in the world right now. Look at that. And I and I blame I blame Mike Flynn and Alex because they've been tapping the they're tapping the love. See how fast it's coming in. The love's coming in. You can't even you can't even tap it that. Look at it. Look, it's exploding. <laughs> I'm a superstar now. Uh 10,800. Get it's going up. Caden Youngquist is there. Caden Youngquist. Is, look, Caden Youngquist is doing it as well. Look at it. I'm the biggest star in the world on TikTok. <laughs> Oh, it's brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. If I could only get 1% of the TikTokers to come to YouTube, we would have a 1,000 people watching me tomorrow. Easy. Uh, it'd be amazing. I could retire on all the one cents per, per person, per ad. Be brilliant. Caden's just joined in as well. Caden Youngquist. Hey, Caden, do you like the screen? See that? Oh, and Alex, have you noticed I've turned the screen round? Have you noticed? Does it make sense now? The clock's the right time. Look, I've set the clock for you in the UK time. Do you like that? The clock is set for you in UK time. All right. Flipping out, we're on 11,000 likes now. TikTok is on fire. TikTok are going to phone me up on the phone in a minute, in a minute and say, Martin Lucas, you've got to slow down. You are the biggest star on, on TikTok. It's never, it's never happened in the history of ever. We've never seen anything like it. Uh, <laughs> right. All right, enough of this nonsense. Tomorrow, 
it begins. All right, that's it. I'm gonna end the show right now. I'm gonna uh, end the show. I'm not even doing a commercial. I'm just gonna end the show. Right, that's it. Gonna end the show right there. Right, folks, we're off. Thank you ever so much, everyone, for being here. Uh, we're gonna end the vote right now. Did we get any, any, anyone? 13 likes. There you go, 13 likes. We'll be live in the morning for my birthday show. It's gonna be a bit of fun. Uh, buy and buy and buy. Uh, Bill, we've got Bill now over on TikTok banging the thing. Look, we've got 12 and a half thousand likes now. 12 and a half thousand likes. I am the most popular person on TikTok. Night all, we're off, we're off. Let me get out, let me get out of the show. Bye bye and bye and bye. All right, end, the, end there, look. That's it, what a day. Today we've changed our strategy. In fact, we haven't changed our strategy. We've gone back to what grew my portfolio in the first place from $5,000 to 58. We've moved into, some div into dividend stocks, which will earn me money, which I will reinvest. Uh, we've, also, we've also moved into um, VU, which will underpin my portfolio, which will give me 10% a year minimum. Should be, be more like 15 and 16. And especially now with this big dip, I'm going to see... Uh, um, it, it pulled back pretty quick. Moose. Moose has just joined on TikTok. Everyone's gone crazy on TikTok. <laughs> Do you like the screen? Look at the screen. That's Puru Invest there, right for you there. Absolutely brilliant. It's getting better every day. Nice. Do I pay tax? Of course I pay tax. We all pay tax unless we're, unless we're criminals. Uh, anyway, that's it. Looks pretty good. I'll see you back in the morning. I want to say take care of yourselves and each other.